Chuani spokesman Selby Bokoba said the city lost 300 megawatts of power following the vandalism incident. Chuani city spokesperson Selby Bokoba said power lines fell to the N4 motorway around 9 p.m. on Sunday, resulting in a power outage affecting large parts of northern and eastern Pretoria. Further investigation revealed that about three pylons were destroyed, causing power lines to collapse and crash into the roadway, closing the highway. Bokoba said the city lost 300 megawatts of power due to the vandalism incident. Areas currently without electricity include Beviansko Prison, Boschko, Baltfontein, Dadeport, Door Entrance, Asterast, East Lynn, Gasfontein, Glenway Mansion, Group Lie East and West Honing, Miss Kranz, Kamildrif, Bakery Park, Koedispor, Lefontein, Mamelodi, Montana, Montana Park, Montana Gardens, Moor Globe, Pretorius Park, Squeegee Wood Park, Royal Sable Hill, Silverton, Cineville, Gasfontein Extension, Waltz Waterfall, Waverly Woodville, Wooded Area, Sequoia, Get Bertram, Koedispor, Industry, Eden Park. Jen Yaman Park Pyramid Hector Fontaine Team last half areas that have successfully restored strength house to die riding Ferry Glen Hazel in Lombardy Mansion Lombardy Me and the Littleton Mukluf Morelita Park Olympus Paramount Mansions Pretorius Extension 40 Shear 6 Lakes Savages Tiger Valley Acre of Willow Woodlands Boulevards Rave Report The municipality will keep its consumers informed of the developments and apologize for the inconvenience, Bokoba said. A Montana resident said the power outage affected his family and some relatives were unable to work from home. The power outage is affecting our network connection. My parents work from home but cannot work from home because of the network. Especially my father had go another place go work. There is no network available, he said. Read, strong indications that guilt plays a role here, vandalism linked collapse of Chone Pylon A Littleton resident told News24 the area has been without power since Sunday evening and only returned Monday afternoon. He added that Netcare United's hospital was also without electricity during the outage. Bokoba said they prioritized the Pumilani substation that feeds main Lodi and other areas. If needed, we may still have to apply rotational load shedding in prominent areas. Consumers are being advised that some areas that have been restored may experience a possible trip, he said. Electricity Minister Koziento Ramakopa visited the crash site on Tuesday afternoon and met with officials from Chani City.